All right, so committing to a healthy diet and a rigorous workout plan, that's not easy for anyone, let alone a 16-year-old who is battling a neurological disorder that weakens the major muscles in the body. Anchor Lori Tucker had an inspiring chat with Wyatt Montalvo. It's about well, building more than just muscle. Here's this week's Positively Tennessee. He makes pull-ups look easy. If you look at him, he's just amazing because he pushes himself nonstop. A rack of dumbbells is next. Time for shoulder presses. 16-year-old Wyatt Montalvo is a regular at workout anytime in Sevierville. Sometimes on Saturdays I'll get here two times a day, one in the morning, one at night. He has transformed his obstacles in front of him and turn them into positive. The biggest challenge, a debilitating muscle weakening disease called Charcot-Marie Tooth. Wyatt has it along with his mom and sister who share his positive outlook. My first week of college, he wrote me a workout plan. <laughs> he was telling me how to do curls with my backpack. I wanted to be an inspiration for people with CMT, you know, and it just drives me, you know. Wyatt was also motivated by bullies. When I was 13 years old, I was 240 pounds and I had some people make fun of me. He took a before picture, believing in himself, knowing somehow he would achieve results like this three years later. I weigh 175 right now. It's what happens when you don't give up. If you have a dream, just push for it. Just take the negativity that people give you and just like use it as fuel to strive for your dreams. In Sevierville, Lori Tucker, WATE, six on your side. Oh my gosh, Wyatt, good for you. You are awesome. Wyatt has his eyes on his next goal, by the way. That is to prep for a bodybuilding competition. Now he's taking his time, making a plan, and hopes to compete next year. Of course, we're going to let you know if he does. For more on uh, CMT disorder and Wyatt's story, head over to WATE.com.